सो हाय एवरीवन टुडे वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट वन ऑफ द फास्टेस्ट फजी मैचिंग एल्गोरिदम्स नॉट नोन बाय मेनी दैट इज द बीके ट्री सो द बीके ट्री यूज टू मेजर कॉन्सेप्ट वन इज द लेवेंस्टीन डिस्टेंस एंड अदर इज द ट्राइंगल इन इक्वालिटी एंड यूजिंग दिस इट हेल्प अस इन गोइंग हेल्प एग्जीक्यूट फजी मैचिंग लॉजिक ओवर अ सेट ऑफ वोकेबलरी सो लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड हाउ अ बीके ट्री इज क्रिएटेड एंड हाउ दिस बीके ट्री कैन बी यूज फॉर फजी मैचिंग so assume that we have vocabulary of uh, with these words book books cake boo boo and etc uh, uh, for creating a bk tree you first need to select a root node assume it to be book for us now we will go through each and every remaining word in this particular dictionary calculate the levenstein distance with the root node and make the root node and make this word a child of the dictionary uh, a child of the root node or uh, with levenstein distance as the edge weight if uh like for example assume that the first word that comes after book is books so the levenstein distance between books and book equals to 1 and hence we create a new child with the weight 1 similarly when a new word cake comes in the levenstein distance is 4 and we create another child for book that is with levenstein distance 4 now for the third iteration if any word comes up with the same levenstein distance as existing for the root node so for example uh assume that the third word that comes is boo So now Levenstein distance between book and boo equals to one. But as you can see that uh, one child for book, which has a Levenstein distance equals to one, that is books, already exist. So in that case, what we will do that we will uh, slide down to that particular child which has the same Levenstein distance with the root node, and then calculate uh, the Levenstein distance of boo with books. And eventually, if for this uh, new parent uh, there doesn't exist any child with the same Levenstein distance, we will create it as a child for it. so you you can see that boo first of all goes to book they have a levenstein distance of 1 as one already exists it goes to that particular parent a child which has the same distance uh, again we calculate the levenstein distance books and uh, eventually we create a new child boo now similarly we will go through all and uh, all words in the dictionary and create this particular tree so we will again uh, pick up an example for example we pick up cook now we will first uh, calculate the levenstein distance with book So the Levenstein distance between cook and book equals to one, as the child already exists. Uh, we will calculate the Levenstein distance with book, books now, uh, which equals to two. Now you can see that boo already exists with a uh, with Levenstein distance two. Now we will again slide down and calculate the Levenstein distance with boo. Now the Levenstein distance comes equals to two, as uh, boo doesn't have a child with the Levenstein distance two. Cook becomes its child now. This is how Levenstein this uh, tree is created. Next, we will see how we can search out. Ah, uh, we can figure out fuzzy matching from a Levenstein tree. So first of all, we need to set up a tolerance threshold. Ah, uh, say equals to t. Ah, uh, so assume that we have a uh, the word for which we would be searching out in the fuzzy match is called as query. Ah, uh, so ah uh, for considering the children of any parent node, ah uh, the distance the Levenstein distance has to be in the limits of ah uh, Levenstein distance between parent query minus t. Levenstein distance between parent query plus t, where t is a uh, tolerance threshold that we have set already. So, if the, uh, the Levenstein distance between parent and the new word for which we are trying to figure out the fuzzy match is between this limit, then only we will be considering the child of that particular parent. If the Levenstein distance between the child and the query is less than t, less than equal to t, then we will consider that particular word as a potential uh, candidate for fuzzy match. so uh, let's uh, let's uh, this kind be a bit confusing so we will be going through a particular example assume that uh, we pick up a word care and we try to, and we are trying to figure out the fuzzy match between for care in, in the given dictionary what can which words are fuzzy match with uh, care so the first word uh, in our b tree is book so uh, the levenstein distance between uh, book and care equals to 4 as i told you that uh, if book would have been a fuzzy match for care the levenstein distance between the book uh, book and query should be less than or equal to t as t equals to 1 and we have a levenstein distance equals to 4 so book can't be considered as a levenstein as uh, uh, as a potential candidate uh, uh, the limits for uh, book uh, for, for considering its children would be uh, 3 comma 5 because as the levenstein distance between book and care is 4 And uh, we have t equals to one, so uh, uh, Levenstein distance four minus one equals to three, and four plus one equals to five. 
so all the children of book which have a levenstein distance between this particular limit will be now considered so if you look in this particular example uh this particular right tree gets rejected completely because the levenstein distance in book and books is 1 and the limit that we have got is 3 comma 5 as one doesn't lie in that we will be rejecting this but we will considering the uh, left hand side of this particular tree the k k pen card because the levenstein distance in book and k is equals to 4 which lies in between 3 and uh, 3 comma 5 so now next what we will be doing is that uh, we would be considering the levenstein distance between cake and care because uh, this particular left hand side of the tree has been considered which is equal to 1 uh, as this particular word uh, fulfills the condition levenstein uh, word comma query is less than equal to t as cake and care uh, have a levenstein distance equal to 1 we will be considering cake as a similar word now uh, going down in the, uh, the for the children for cake uh, the we will be calculating the limits now so 0 comma 2 because as you got levenstein distance equals to 1 uh, 1 minus t 1 plus t so 0 comma 2 so all the children of cake that lies between 0 to 0 comma 2 would now be considered for uh, um, finding a fuzzy match for the word care as both of these children have a levenstein distance 1 comma 2 uh, we would be considering both of them now we will be considering we will be calculating a levenstein distance for cape comma care equals to 1 which is less than equal to 1 hence cape is also can be a potential fuzzy match but levenstein distance between cart and care equals to 2 which is greater than 1 hence we will be rejecting cart so out of this particular leven, uh, 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 bk tree we have got two common words two similar words potential words that is cake and cape so on putting a threshold or t equals to 1 the fuzzy match found for care are cape and cake using bk tree so as you uh, as you have seen that uh, we saved a lot of calculations because we have completely ignored the right tree because uh, and just and out of a uh, seven words we have made a comparison with just four uh, we have, uh, out of eight words we have made comparison with just four of them that hence we have rejected 50% of the uh, vocabulary hence saving a lot of computation and hence a very fast algorithm